Yes, sir. I am definitely ready to get back here. Uh, I've been waiting, waiting all year. I've actually been waiting since the end of last season to come back. Um, been spending some time with the family, but now I'm ready and uh, I'm with my family here in St. Louis. Well, we have a, a like a rookie, a rookie mini camp that we're gonna have 21st and 22nd for about two days with the new guys uh, to go over stuff. And our, some of our signed guys are in town, but camp does official camp for our season doesn't start till March 8th. Uh, I'm most ready to uh, get our boys back focused and uh, also channel, I know the anger and uh, you know, them wanting to get back and make up redemption, I think is the best word for it, for this new season. I'm ready to get back out there for to redeem ourselves because I feel like we, we, we didn't do the best performance we could have at the end and I still feel like we have something to prove. I think most of all they need to focus on that this isn't last season. Last season's over with. So I think they need to, you know, take that off, but I also think they need to have a chip on their shoulder that they have something to prove, something that, that we didn't gain all our goals, we didn't reach all our goals last year. And I think they need to come in hungry and strong and I think they're gonna be disciplined like we were last year. And I think the main thing to improve on is I think our offense is the main thing that we need to improve on, especially the wide receiver position. The roster's shaping up very well. We've been uh, going all over the country looking for people, especially in St. Louis, Missouri. We've been at every school and university and trying to call everybody we can, and every apartment complex in St. Louis, trying to find everybody we can. And um, I think our roster looks very good. we got a bunch of local talents, a bunch of local great players here. And I think that it's going to be a great show for not only the country, but especially for the people from here. <clears throat> I think in professional football, it's a very big thing not to have a huge turnover, like, like at McDonald's or something like that. I think, as you can see in the NFL, you know, the teams that succeed year to year, the teams that don't have the 20, 15, 10 guy turnover every year, it's almost impossible to, to win when you have to reteach everything and when guys have to come together and feel like a family, it takes time. And I think that you get rid of them, you bring in a new guy, it, it, they have to build. Marion, Cape Fear, Corpus Christi, uh, all three of those teams were in the championship or won the championship of their league last year. To go along with Florida and ourselves, it's going to be a packed house in there and getting into the playoffs is going to be a hard, hard thing. And that's why I think that, you know, the couple new roster guys that we brought in are really to upgrade the team and help out with the new challenges of the league. Learn from our losses, try as hard as we can to prepare harder than our opponents to win every game. And most of all, more, most importantly, to win the last game of the season. Fans should come out to see the attack because it's a great football product on the field. Not only is it a great football product and you know success, everybody wants to see winning, but wins or losses aside, the local guys, to show you guys the local talent that you do have. You guys do have great local talent here in St. Louis and in Missouri and the whole state. So I think it's good for the local guys to come out here and see that the local fans to come out and see the local product that they've grown and watched all through high school and college. And we can do it professionally too. I think that's a great thing.